Okay, the next thing I want to show you is how to add an outbound link in your content. Now, the one important thing you want to remember when you're adding the outbound link is you want to link to a high authority source. What that tells Google is you're not selfish and you don't mind if people come to your blog and click and go somewhere else. Okay, now the way you do that is you got your content here, right? Okay, so if you see in my blog here, let's scroll down. Okay. Okay, if you look here, it says SEO marketing. Now it links, it has a hyperlink to it. Now if you click it, it's going to take you to Wikipedia and it explains search engine marketing. Wikipedia is a high authority source and that is the best place to link to. You can link all your blogs to that. So whatever your topic is, if it's gym equipment, web hosting, uh, how to preach a sermon, you're going to find it on Wikipedia. So what I usually do is I usually link out to Wikipedia, okay, because it's a very high authority source. And what you're telling Google is, look, I don't mind if people come to my blog, blog and click somewhere else because I'm not selfish. Google likes that. Now, if you notice, the wording in my outbound link is SEO marketing. It says here, example, if I am using the keyword SEO marketing, I can use that word to link to Wikipedia as an authoritative source. This is very helpful when trying to optimize your blog post for SEO. So I clicked, I mean, I put a hyperlink to Wikipedia. The word is SEO marketing, my keyword is how to do SEO for a website. So once again, that outbound link keyword is related to the keywords in my blog title and what I'm trying to rank for. Okay, so that is how you add an outbound link to your content. Wow, this is exciting. You are learning SEO and this is going to take your Google rankings to another level. Let's get into the next lecture.